AI for me is a collaboration between the BBC, the University of Surrey and the University of Lancaster. And it's all about the future of media and how do we create that flexible media that we can then personalize and create new experiences tailored to you. So we have a five year program. We're just at the beginning, the first year of the program. But overall, what we want to achieve is is enable the step change to allow the production of personalized content. And we want to create the tools, the technologies that we can then put into the hands of the creative industries. We know if we create the right tools, people with creative expertise will take those and create amazing experiences from it. Essentially, there are two main challenges. One is around the capture of content in an object-based way, and the other is around distributing that content in an affordable and sustainable way. I've been really impressed with how far developed the whole thing is and how well thought through it is. The BBC, I think, has a really outsized role in the wider media market and also globally to sort of set standards and set the direction for ethical, responsible use of new technologies. A lot of what this may develop, and certainly what the indications are, gives that gives that opportunity for people to engage in, in, in both the public service and in the commercial space. I think there's a real risk that there are unconscious biases being built into the basic architecture of artificial intelligence. I think the BBC's remit as public broadcaster brings that inclusiveness is taken into account. I think BBC is critical to this. Its uh, role, I see its role greatly as pushing these things forward and it can also really position the UK as a leader in this area. So AI for me is a partnership. It's a partnership led by the BBC and University of Surrey. So it's really a collaboration. We've probably got at the moment something like 30 companies in the room who are directly feeding into this and that network will expand out as we go forward.